<laughs> First of all, let me see if I can make some TMs because Lord knows I need it. Like, I really need it. Gimme ghoul. Okay. Let's swap Sayus to the front. Okay, let's see the TMs we can make. Always the fun part. Well, I mean, some of these we just can't. Surprise, Piper voice is here though. What is this? Something. Flame charge. Water pulse is there. I guess I just need more materials. Can I? Oh, it's exchange materials for LP. Dang. Oops, I don't want to get that much. I mean, I can still teach them some new stuff at least. Frickin' acid spray. Actually, it harshly lowers their special defense stat. You know what? I can dig that. I can actually dig that. Neither of them want that. Uh, he's already got a good grass move. Eh. I'm still surprised that Seus can learn Chilling Water. Sod, Pax, Snarl, Metal Claw. Stored Power. Oh. Uh. Dragon Tail. He already has Dragon Claw, so that's fine. Why is it like... Did you hear the music bugging out? Don't forget Psychic over Psychic Shock. Yeah, I really should right now. God, foul play. It's really good. Bulk up. I mean, I should have it, do I not? Oh yeah, here's Shadow Ball and Psychic. I'm gonna keep Psych Psy Shock around, but replace Lava Plume with Psychic. Just in case. You don't have Surf yet, do you? I mean, it'll be better than Dive, I'm pretty sure. Ice Spinner. No one can learn Ice Spinner. Yikes. He can learn Ice Beam. Hyper Beam. Uh, is that really all I want on them, though? I was kind of hoping someone could get Thunder Punch or something. We already have Gigaton Hammer, that's really good. Foul play. Oh! You know what? Yes, have a... Uh... Take that over Night Slash. No, no. No dragon moves. You get like rock slide.
I mean, I'll take Rock Slide over Rock Tomb. If anyone wants it, it's probably you. I might actually do it over Skitter Smack. Struggle Bug counts. Hmm. U turn's pretty nice. Not that I can get it at the moment, but it would be nice. Psychic Fangs. Zen Headbutt, Sci Shot. Oh, actually. Do I have acrobatics as a TM? No, I don't. I need watch roll and something else. Some of these I'm surprised I don't have in my inventory. And some of these I'm also very sad that I don't have in my inventory. Because there's... oh god. Do I need to, like, go farm for materials? Is that what this has come to? Absolutely no one can learn these poison moves. Huh. Oh, we can just straight up craft Aura Spear. Ice Fang, huh? I think he has Ice Beam, which is not fantastic, but it's not terrible. For, for him, I mean, it'd be better on uh, someone else. Anyway. Let's actually go to the Academy after dark. I'm sure is uh, not a trap. Wow, it just kind of shows their faces instead of like uh, the gym leaders and stuff, which makes sense. All right. It's after dark, I believe. Hi. Sup, Bray. <laughs> Director Clebel. Oh, come on. The name's Clive, remember? Actually, no. It's time for me to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. Ha-ha! Oh my god. It's Director Clebel. And do apologize for deceiving you with my disguise. In truth, the boy you knew as Clive was none other than the director of Naranja Academy. Mr. Clavel. No way! Yes, this must be quite the shock. My disguise was perfect after all. Regardless, there is still one more astonishing truth I must reveal to you. The true identity of Cassiopeia, the big boss of Team Star, was me all along! That's literally impossible. Yeah, that that's impossible. Honest to goodness. When you heard Cassiopeia over the phone, it, that was actually a pre-recorded voice. I pulled it off using, uh, you know, one of those high-tech gizmos. Oh yes, it was very clever. So, Miss Frey, now that you now you know I'm the big boss, that means there is just one thing left to do. Face me in one final showdown to decide it all. Oh. It's, uh... Is, is the serious music? I am Cassiopeia of Team Star. With this battle, I am... Okay. Well, 
I didn't need to see that anyway. Oh, he also knows foul play! Well, that worked out. A bomb of snow, huh? Well, I can just use Vex for that. Look at the guy in the background cheering. He's not looking at us. He's not even cheering for this battle. He's just having a good time. Oh, you just had to make it a snow warning, didn't you? Gyarados. I hate it when they use Gyarados! Dang it. Ah, oh, even more dang it. Ah, oh, triple dang it. Wait. It probably knows Ice Fang. Poltegeist. Well, I, I think that's just a ghost type. Well, hold on. Let me just, like, revive the one you killed. Jerk. Oh. Okay, hello low poly, er, not low poly, but low frame rate student. <laughs> oh, yep, there he is. Look at him go. using Shell Smash, that's, uh, that's not good. Uh, do, do I go first? Oh, no, I probably don't go first. Okay. Well, that worked out. I like it when he tries to celebrate, but he gets damaged. Amoongus. Amoongus. Wow, I, I actually did not. I didn't teach Virilis any new moves, except for Surf. Anyway. That is much smaller than I expected. They're staring each other down. So, um... 
Is the only effective one I have gonna be Virilis? <laughs> to think that I, Cassiopeia, would be backed into a corner like this. Very well, it seems I shall have to terrestrialize my Pokemon. Is, is it, um, is it fire? Stop flipping me off! How much is that going to do? Oh. Not that bad. Oh, right. It's pure fire type right now. Do take a step back, please. This may get dangerous. Torch song. Oh! Can I, uh, swap out? Hmm. I'm not sure who's faster. But I'm just gonna bet on it being me. I also might be hoping that it is. He's got the power. Perfect. I should probably start just expanding force. Um, exits target with psychic power when the ground is psychic terrain. Eh. We're not going to be on psychic terrain that much. How strong you have grown. Thanks. Well now, Miss Frey. Seems you have grown quite splendidly over the course of your treasure hunt. And here, once again, I must apologize. I am not actually Cassiopeia. Though Clive and myself being the same person was no lie, mind you. Cassiopeia's true identity remains hidden, but I believe I can hazard a guess as to who they may be. That is why I sought to spare you from having to confront them in battle. Their sorrows should not be yours to bear. However, Cassiopeia has settled on a course of action and is determined to see it through. I do not imagine any ordinary student could hope to stand against them and win, so I challenged you to a battle to test your skill. If you had lost, it would have fallen to me to bring down Cassiopeia. Such was my resolve. But it turns out you are as strong as you are kind. If anyone has a chance at saving that poor child, it is surely you. As an educator, it shames me to burden one of my students with such a task. But please, defeat Cassiopeia. Take on the big boss of Team Star and win. Yes, sir. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. I leave this in your hands. 
You there, what do you think you're doing? Time. Is is that the sister of the gym leader? Rhyme? It's no pleasure at all, Mr. Clavel. I come here to investigate reports of an illicit battle on school grounds, and what do I find? Why, the director of the academy himself, facing it off against one of our students, no less. What were you thinking? Uh, no, if I could just explain. You see, it is a rather sad tale. Oh, spare me! Your excuses reek worse than a stunky's behind! A uh, stunky's behind? Ahem. Remember, the big boss asked us to meet them in the schoolyard after dark. I'm counting on you, Miss Frey. I'll write a letter of apology to the students and faculty at once. And I'll be reporting this to the chairwoman of the school board, make no mistake. Good gracious, no, anything but that, I implore you. Oh, I got a full heal. Oh, it's, it's already saving. That's cool. 